What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Jack and Daxter Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing the Lost Precursor City. <laughs> I almost forgot it again like I did in the last video. Let's go. All right, and this is like one of the coolest parts to me. Going down this little thing because you can see the building as you go down. And I don't know, it just looks cool. And now we're... Oops. All right, made it back down here. I'm an idiot. I, love... I cannot speak. I'm an idiot. I am a idiot. God dang. All right. So to begin, I'm going to try to come over here. I don't know if I really like this area too much, to be honest. Like I like how the elevator thing looks, but just this area in general, I am not the biggest fan of. By far is not the worst level we have yet to get there. I think I'll be in the whole next area. And I'm sure everyone will know what I'm talking about right now, even without giving hints. I don't know if Force Area is a good way to see it, but it's just an area that I never really liked as a kid or replaying it as an adult. All right, we're down here. Let's hit that so we can collect all these orbs. No, that's not what I wanted to do. No. Oh, it doesn't really matter. All right, let's get over here. My movement right now is terrible. Okay, so you want to hit the head off first and then the body. Grab this. Roll back over here. Hit the button again. And we want to grab that blue eco again because we want to be able to uh, open up that blue eco vent over here. And boom, right there. Not too hard. All right, I believe after this we should be able to, uh, what is that over there? I don't think I've ever noticed that platform. We should be able to, uh, do the Oracle. <laughs> oh, I just going blank right now. Holy crap. All right. That platform is just where I got the, uh, scout fly. All right. And now we can make our way out of this room through that little hallway up there. We got all the orbs and stuff in here, I believe. Make it across. All right. I almost just like did that right off the edge. Oh god, that was close. Okay. Don't really like this area. So I'm kind of being negative about this level. I don't know why. I've, I've just never really liked it. I don't know if there's like a real reason why or not. Alright, um... The only good thing about this level are like the colors of it. I think the atmosphere of it is cool, but maybe it's just a level design or something. I don't know. And we are in the big room. Um, first things first, we should probably go for that. So let's just get these ready for us to jump across them. Alright, this jump is going to be kind of annoying because I have to grab those two things and then jump around this corner. Yeah, I'm going to wait for that to get back over on the other side. Go, 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 go. And I'm lagging. Holy crap. I think we got it. Except we got hit by that. Holy crap. That would have sucked if I died there. Oh god. I'm one hit. I can't be doing stupid things. Yeah, I don't know if there's a platform under me, actually. Okay, there's... Oh. I didn't realize there was this, uh... Luiko. Which I might have actually grabbed without realizing it. And I think we could... Oh, we can't? Okay, we can. Okay. Yeah, if you just need a little bit of extra, like, height and stuff, you could do the circle button. Oh, nice. Cool. Which is fine. I didn't want to spawn back here, though. 
As I said, it's gonna reset that room anyways, like the blue platform, so... Dying that was kind of fun. Okay, we got that done. We are gonna have to head back over there, I think, because we need to get both those scout flies. And then there's precursor orbs right under me too, which I have to remember. Uh, it takes so long. I think that's one of the reasons why I don't like this area is because these things just take forever to like situate how you need them. All right, we are almost there. One more rotation and that should be good. Um. Okay, as you say, it has to be this way. Alright. I was gonna jump there, but I wanted to be safe. Okay. Time to head back. Now we want to situate this to the middle of the room. And then I think that's all we actually need these for. Because the rest of it... We... We can just jump across those platforms. Okay, where is it at? Alright. Let's hit this one. I'm pretty sure that's the one that takes us in the lab make much more sense. And it is. Let's go. Quick! Follow that pipe! I'm going. Alright, we'll get those precursor orbs in the middle of the room after I do this. I kind of want to jump over there and get that scout fly before I start this. Just so I don't have to waste the time to do it in the middle of the run. Alright. Let's do this thing. Goes all the way up there. Hopefully we have enough time. I'm already wasting time. Go, 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 go. to do this on the first place. Okay, we got it. <laughs> I was gonna say, I cannot afford to stop there. I probably would've been fine though, because it wasn't like going that fast. Okay, and then before we head through that door, I'm just gonna do this and hopefully... No, quick, I missed. Almost made it. Grab these things. We officially have enough to get the Oracle things. Oh god. All right, and then this room. We're gonna try to get all these first. All right, and then we should be able to get the rest, right? Yeah, as soon as I collect that one, I'm jumping for the middle. All right, cool. Let's go, we got another one. Let's wait for these to go back to normal and then we can jump across here. There was another door on the right. No, that was a window. Okay. These guys can be kind of annoying to kill. Just because they're, they hit you pretty easily. All you gotta do though is jump and do that on them. Whatever that's called. Ground pound. <laughs> okay, there's that room. And then... Oh. And then he stops. Yeah, they're much easier if you just... Now, let them stop. Okay, nice. I took way too much damage there. Does this turn green or is it just whirlpools? Okay, it turns green. Was that even a question? Oh, I missed one. Alright. I believe there's like a, a good way to do this. I don't actually remember. I think we start from this side. So you want to land on each platform. I think one time without like jumping on a blue one again. Okay, I think I got this right. Get the corner. Forward one. This one. This one. This one. And then finally this one. Let's go! And then we can hop in here and grab the power cell. Hey. 
You know what it is. I don't think the music is bad in this area. But I also don't really kind of like it. <laughs> that might be one of the reasons why I don't like this area. Because, like, actually playing it isn't terrible. Other than those stupid blue platforms. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna wait for the second cycle here. Go, go, go! Once again, hit the head off. Boom. Boom. I always get scared because I'm at one hit before I die. And I know one single, like, little movement will kill me. Okay. Let's just get this real quick. I don't know why I didn't double jump there. That was pretty dumb of me. Oh, we are right here anyways. Uh, I knew that was gonna happen. I was just gonna say screw it anyways. Save a little bit of time. Alright, let's do this again. Actually double jump. Um, this part is kind of annoying because I think you have to come back to this area. Oh god, that was actually a pretty tight, uh, timer. I could be wrong too, but I'm pretty sure that door... What is it? I totally forget. There's something with that door. But I guess we'll just go down the slide and then see what happens. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. Okay, so we gotta go down here. It's actually good to be at one hit going down these slides because it's very easy to miss stuff. So if you're a one hit, you could just hit something and reset. And then you can actually destroy these metal boxes. Alright. So far so good. It just kind of sucks if you do it at the very end. I was gonna get rid of these guys just... Because they can be a problem if I don't. Okay. So we want to use the blue eco to activate these things. I believe they are on a timer. And we'll stop uh, being activated after a certain amount of time. Yeah. Oh, that's why I said you should take care of them first. Okay. Round two. Let's get rid of you. Uh, uh, yeah. Let's get rid of you. And then this guy. And then we're gonna head up and take care of these guys before we start activating stuff. You can get out. You can get out of here. Is that all? I think so. Okay. That's us. Number two. At least we had a checkpoint right there. Well, again, I think that that's why I said it's kind of annoying because I, I still think there's something up there that I have to do. I just can't think of what it is. Now. There we go. Alright. Let's just hop back over here. This door just opens and let's see what happens. Boom. I kind of mentioned this in the last episode. I didn't talk about it or say anything about it, but like I ran up to where I'm supposed to go to get to it because I thought that the power cell was kind of just floating there. I forgot it was like actually wow. under and gets you pushed up. A piece of the underwater ruins to the surface. It seems you can use eco in ways we've never seen before. A power cell. Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. I thought you were going to keep talking. I moved my mic, so if you were like a weird noise, that's what that was. <laughs> Get me in! Don't want to mess with the lurker. Alright, bring me back down. Alright, apparently you wanted to spawn the enemies back in. That's cool. I don't really... Dude... <laughs> I was just gonna say, I don't... 
I am. I am dumb. I was gonna look around the room, make sure there's nothing where I was missing. Like hurt. Should I call for backup? Okay. We spawn here anyways. Okay. Let's just go this way. I'm just making stupid mistakes right now. I apologize. Okay, that was a quick one. Okay, we have another slide here. Which makes me think I did miss something. So I'll probably have to run. Thank you for letting me grab that. <laughs> I was just about to complain about uh, falling off. So actually we do want to be one hit for this, so uh, I'm going to do that. Because like I said before, it's easy to miss stuff on here, so if you're one hit, you can just easily hit something and reset. Nice. I'm actually going to pause real quick so I can put that down, just so I don't forget. <gasps> no! Okay, I'll be right back. All right, made it back to the slide. I need to remember where that jump was so that I don't do it again. The jump like to the side a little bit. Dude, hello? Okay, I'm back here again. I'm gonna actually get hit real quick, just so I'm one hit. I mean, if I didn't do this, it would honestly make it easier to grab this. But I just I want to be careful about it. Dude, come on, game. Okay, I'm going in this with two health this time. I'm going to be upset if I die. <laughs> or, or if I don't. Or, okay, I'm going to be upset if I die. Uh, and I'm going to be upset if I miss something and can't like reset myself. Okay, that's fine. Dude, are you kidding me? I'm almost near the end. Okay. That should be fine. As long as I jump properly over stuff. Okay, nice. Finally made it. <laughs> Let's get this power cell. On a weird platform. I got a bad feeling about this. Now I will say, as much as I was talking the crap about this level, this is probably one of the coolest parts of this game, I would say, in my opinion. It's like a time rush kind of event. Run away from the dark ego rising up. Okay, make sure we don't miss anything. We're almost there. Oh, I missed it. Okay. Jump! I'm like really focusing right now, so I'm not really talking. Because it is kind of easy to like mess up here, like if you miss a jump or anything. Or like right there, I just made a big mistake. Not enough to get me killed, I don't think, but it easily could have. Okay, nice. Uh okay, I was just making sure there's nothing in here. Okay, actually, I don't think we did miss anything. I think I was getting not confused. I don't know. I think I was just remembering wrong. Is that all? Okay, yeah, that's all for this area. And then that. Okay, yeah, I was definitely just misremembering it, like this doorway. So, uh, we can easily just go back down here and then ride up the little elevator thing. We can probably backtrack too to go back to the start, but this is much faster. Make sure we dodge everything. And boom. Alright. 
fire this back up, we are probably going to go visit the Oracle and get the two power cells from it. Thanks for the ride, buddy. Alright, let's get over here once again. I think we should be fine from the lurker shark here with the rocks underneath us. I do think having this be like mostly a water area is kind of annoying because it's just so slow. You have to take these little like trails that you have to jump across to get to where you're trying to go. Alright, we are here hop up here, across this little bridge, and then head all the way to the left. And then the next area we're going to go is actually a uh, swamp. Here is another power cell for your quest. And I will say as a child, I like hated it. I just didn't like it. I didn't like the atmosphere. I didn't like the level design, but now I don't really mind it that much. For your sacrifice, I offer you a power cell. It's definitely not my favorite like area or anything right now. I just, I just really don't mind it. I don't think it's that long of a level and it does have kind of a fun little mini game in it where you're like shooting little rats with the yellow eco, which I don't think we've actually been introduced to yet. So spoiler alert. <laughs> All right, we are going to go get ready right in front of it, though. And look at that. It's already like powered up and stuff. She's just waiting for us. But even though we have the power cells, we are not going to go over there just yet. This is a platinum playthrough after all, 100%. Alright, and just to be sure, Fire Cannon, that's complete. Rocky Village, that's complete. Lost Precursor City, that is complete. Precursor Basin, that is complete. Let's check this real quick, and it is all good. Oh, that's Miss Yen. But, uh, yeah, that'll do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.